kids on spring break got the yeah. perfect week for it, didn't oh, they? Oh, yeah. This is the week to have spring break if there is one because it's definitely not going to be next week because mm -hmm. we are seeing big changes on the way. And I'll get into those in just a minute. But here's something that everyone across New Mexico is really getting used to right now. And that's lots of sunshine. In addition to all the sunshine, we are also seeing very nice temperatures. 61 degrees is the current temperature in the metro. A west wind at only 3 miles per hour. Over the northern mountains, we're looking at temperatures mainly in the 50s. In the 60s, as you move through central sections and into the upper 60s and low 70s down to the south and even into the 70s as you move up toward Clayton and Tucumcari. Winds not too bad across much of the state, but we are starting to see breezy conditions over the northeast. 12 mile per hour winds in Raton as well as Las Vegas. 14 mile per hour winds in Santa Fe and the northeast once again for today will be one of the target areas to see at least elevated winds, but we're not talking a big time wind event by any means. Over the south and eastern part of the state, we are seeing a few clouds streaming through, but we have a huge mess over the northwestern portion of the country, and that mess will eventually move our way, but not until at least the latter part of the weekend and early next week. So between now and then, we will continue to see lots of sunshine for the metro. Meanwhile, western portions, including the Sierra Nevadas, will be picking up on quite a bit of snow. We're expecting up to about three feet of snow in the Sierra Nevadas over the course of this week, and eventually the storm will drop down into Arizona, and this is a very deep trough, so it actually moves south of Arizona and then picks back up into western New Mexico as we move into Monday, and that will deliver us a chance of some snow because this is a very cold system, a lot of cold air associated with this. We're going to see the temperatures drop a good 20 to 30 degrees by the time we reach early next week, and with those colder temperatures and the moisture around, we will be picking up snow, especially over the higher elevations, more in the way of mix and rain showers over the lower elevations as we move into early next week. So big changes on the way, and you'll see that reflected in your zone-by-zone zone forecast, starting off in southern Colorado, where temperatures today, very nice, once again, in the mid to upper 50s, even low 60s in Alamosa with mostly sunny skies. The sunshine continues through the end of the work week, then a few more clouds on Saturday, and temperatures drop as we move into early next week, only into the low 40s with a chance of showers late Sunday into early next week. Over the northwest, temperatures here will be in the low to mid-60s with lots of sunshine. The sunshine continues through Thursday, then a few more clouds Friday and Saturday. Temperatures drop starting starting Sunday into Monday and Tuesday, and the rain showers and even some mixed precip starts in the Farmington area as temperatures drop to only the upper 40s by Tuesday. Over southwest, temperatures here will be in the 70s with lots of sunshine. We stay in the low 70s in Silver City for Thursday and Friday. Then we drop the temperatures back into the 60s for the upcoming weekend. Showers will enter into the forecast late Sunday into early next week as temperatures drop to only the upper 40s to near 50 for daytime highs for Monday and Tuesday. Over the southeast, temperatures here will be in the low to mid 80s with partly sunny skies and will stay in the mid 80s, even reaching the upper 80s by Friday, but then those temperatures start to come back down. A chance of a spot shower on Saturday, much better chances Monday into Tuesday with that storm system coming through. Highs only in the mid 60s by the middle of next week. Over the northeast, temperatures here in the upper 60s for Capulene, low 60s for Mora, 67 for Las Vegas, and then 70s elsewhere, 81 for Tucumcari with mostly sunny skies. We keep the sunshine around through the end of the work week, a few more clouds over the weekend, then a chance of showers as temperatures drop into early next week. Over the northern mountains, temperatures today will be anywhere from the 50s in the higher elevation communities all the way up to 71 in Española with lots of sunshine. The sunshine continues through Thursday and Friday, a few more clouds Saturday and Sunday, then our chance of showers enters the picture Monday into Tuesday with temperatures dropping into the mid-40s. Over the east mountains, temperatures today in the upper 60s with lots of sunshine. We make it to the low 70s in the metro with the sunshine sticking around not only for today but through the end of the work week. And then things get interesting. A few more clouds over the weekend with temperatures dropping back into the 50s for Monday and Tuesday and the chance of showers. So Just hold off till yeah, after the weekend. Yeah, well, I think the weekend <laughs> will be mainly dry and then things won't be looking so good for the start of next week. All right, thank okay. you, John. Well, at yep. least we'll get the weekend. Yes. We'll be right back.